This is a, um, a Thermal Plan Mistrina CS2 um, Starbucks coffee maker. This came out of a closed grocery store that had a Starbucks location in it. And, um, you know, it, it, uh, it does work. It was hooked up. Everything, you know, seems to go. The biggest problem I have at the moment with this thing is that um, if you look at this, it's got the power cord, which normally would have had this dryer cord on it, but we took that off because I don't have this cord here. I'll include that. Put it back on. Anyways, I have it hardwired. And then it comes with, it's got this other piece. This other piece is a just a D-plug, and this plugs into the back of the unit, and it goes to a pressure pump. Pressure pump, of course, the company decided that it was looked better underneath the counter and left it there. So we didn't get it, but I will show you what it does. You turn it on, it says, please rinse unit. Uh, you push rinse. I have it hooked up to water, just a dishwasher hookup line, basically. It's gonna rinse. It'll go through this process, but uh, it's going to give me a flow error in a second because the pump has a flow pressure switch in it. Um, those pumps are available. It's uh, I used to know the name on them. That's interesting. The camera scan rate, I can see the, the scan going across here, but that's not how it looks. It's solid. I can see the, the scan rate of the LCD in the camera, which I imagine you can probably see when I come up to it and see it, but that's not how it actually looks. It's, it's actually clear. I'll take a picture of that. Um, it's got the bucket, it's got the drain, it's got the this piece. None of this stuff's gonna work, unfortunately, without the, without the uh, other piece. That goes decaf. Those are regular beans. As you can see, there's still beans in there. Cap's not bad. Uh, overall, nice condition. A uh, couple of scuffs and scratches, but I mean, this will clean up. This is all steel or brass or something like that. This could be copper or copper coated, and then this is all stainless, and this, this should all clean up pretty nice. Uh, it takes a 3 8 compression line. This is our line going into the thing, so I'm going to take that off. Uh, the adjustment here. For the size of the cup Oops. Um, and then you know if this all worked which I can't override this unfortunately you know it just it's stuck at this uh, yeah I get back to the rinse again uh, yeah, it won't even rinse it just uh, it's pretty much all it does um, if I had the pump, I could show you it running it because I'm sure it would. Other than that, that's the unit. It's going to definitely have to be truck shipped. These are about 250 pounds. It does run on 223 phase, or I'm sorry, 220 single phase. So, you know, yes, you'd need, if you want to put this into your house, you'd have to have a, a plug put in for it. But, uh, you know, standard house current, 220 single phase. Uh, if you have any questions or concerns, let me know. Otherwise, thank you.